The process of creating buildings and city scenes in Blender can be time consuming and tedious in most of the time. So in this video, I'm going to share with you a new Blender add-on that helps you generate procedural high quality buildings to create the best city scenes in the least time possible. This add-on is still in the early access stage and with that you get a 50% discount on the price. Now the add-on is called Urbanic Building Generator. This add-on uses the power of geometry nodes to create the buildings. You can control a basic modulated shape on edit mode and the building will be created automatically in real time with lots of cool details. In the early access period, the add-on provides 7 types of buildings with a predetermined shape and you can change these shapes to fit your needs. The main goal of this add-on is to provide at least 20 different building types when the early access finishes. All of the buildings are created with semi-procedural materials. With them you can change basic parameters like color, grunge, leaking, rust, etc. One single building module with different shapes and colors can work like totally different buildings. Urbanic provides a variety of assets that add depth and character to the building modules. In the early access, you will have two modules, Colonnade, which you can change the shape of it with a NURB curve and its length will adapt to the curve automatically. And the second model is Kubla and you can change his size with the scale function. The model is inspired by the real New York Kubla. Also, the devs are promising to provide at least 20 different elements that will match to the style of the buildings. The add-on also provide bases for the buildings. They are created with the same geometry node setup. This means that you can change the overall shape of it to fit the dimension of your scene. You can add and remove stairs and railings and also these bases can help to level up the terrain and add realism to your composition. All the buildings comes with 3D baked mid poly interiors. This gives you the best looking result for your interior with a relatively low processing cost. They react to the main illumination, casting shadow through the window for example. And in some buildings you can add external air conditioner units with different shapes, color and configuration. Also even some of them have animated fans and you can control the quantity of them as well. In the add-on UI you will find some values to change that will affect your entire scene. These are building lights, it changes the quantity of interiors that are illuminated on the scene, rain that adds animated raindrops, water surfaces to make the materials look wet and snow to add snow over the surface. Now the buildings are the vital part of the city and they usually occupy a big portion of your scene but most of them are not the main element of it. That means that you have to dedicate them a lot of time and effort when they are in the most of the cases just backgrounds. So why not let Urbanic make cool looking and adaptable buildings and you spend the time making the key elements of the scene. Now if you want to check out the add-on, link is in the description. Tell me in the comments below what do you think about this add-on. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this one. Thank you for watching and goodbye.